two combined bands will be performing the national anthem. And Bob Wolf, I understand that we do have another uh, little rarity here, or not rarity, but a little sideline observation that you yourself happen to be a classmate of Tommy Protos of Duke back in 1942. That's right. He was a great athlete there, uh, not only in football, played other sports as well, baseball. Just taking a look at two boots down, I see that Tommy is perched up there with the down apparatus. And how does that work down on the bench, Bob? You've an opportunity to observe the Hollywood State during the year. Well, he, of course, will sit in the uh, booth and use just the regular telephone and headset and work with an assistant coach down on the bench. And uh, he'll have the three fellows. He'll use his three tight ends, Len Perkovich, Doug McDougall, and uh, Sullivan, to rotate and to uh, bring the plays in. So these fellows will be right by the coach with the phone down there. The officials are meeting with the team captains for the toss of the coin right now. The referee today is Edward Wagner, the umpire, Ed Herbert, the headlines and Ted Stirring, the field. We're getting set now for a kickoff to start the Rose Bowl game, and here it comes. It's a long one, going deep and carrying down, three yards deep in the end zone. Being run out by Ward to the 15, to the 20. Jeff 
Osweiler, hit and yardage as he tries the right side. Ophilovich comes up the line of scrimmage and hits a layer. No gain on the play. So the third down coming up, two to go for the first. Timberlake directing the wing tee at the quarterback spot. Gives off this time to Mel Anthony, and the fullback plows his way off the left guard spot for a first down. position with his height. He pitches back to Jetweiler. Jetweiler goes off the right side this time, moves forward to the 27-yard line, where Ophilovich again comes in for the stop. It's Ophilovich, aided on the play by number 37, Dan Seed, who came up with the left half back spot. Took over the ball on the 41 in OSU territory, and they're now moving. And this time it's Ward, who shifts his way off the left side, gets inside the 25 to the 24-yard line. Tackled by Al East, the big right end of the Oregon State University Beavers. Uh, out of the ball game for Michigan comes their defensive end. Third down coming up, four to go. The ball at the 24 in Oregon State territory. Timberlake rolls out to his left. He takes the ball, and he is pulled down from behind. George Carr jumps around his neck from behind, drags him down on the ground. After the advance is just for a yard on the play. This Timberlake and Stephanie needs about 15 yards today to set a brand new Michigan record. Record of 17 yards standing will be broken if he can gain at least 15 yards on the ground. Field goal will be attempted now. Timberlake will attempt from the 30. There's the boot. Looks like it may go short. It does. It drops short just in front of the goal post. Eskelon was back to feel that one. Michigan, the field goal by Timberlake, it's all short, and Oregon State takes over at the 20. All set to go now, as Oregon State takes over on the 20-yard line with first and 10 for the Beavers. There's no score, we're in the first quarter, and here running with the ball is Brothers. He goes turning around the right side, he takes reverse lead, he can't find much yardage as he moves forward on the play, and as he quit along the right side line, Henderson, who is the split end, had to dive back toward the line of scrimmage. First and 10 of the 42. 
Timberlake this time rolls to his left. He fakes the pass. He keeps the ball. He goes to the 45-yard line, post the midfield before he's finally spilled by Jim Smith, the halfback coming up. This Timberlake is a tremendous threat by Blackberry with his ability to either pass or run. I was just thinking as I was watching him run that time, Bob, that as he rolled out around the left side of the line, uh, somebody said he'll give you that real quick shoulder, that dip, and then great. So it's second and three, the ball's the 39. Timberlake this time has to head as he's a free throw for his down. And Henderson is down the 42 yard line. Steve and Martin make the stop for the Beavers as Michigan, on the strength of two passes down to Henderson, picked up two first downs in a row. John Henderson, who is a 6'3", 185 pound senior, it's a first down. And this time, it's a plunge through the center by Mel Anthony as Anthony gets to the 38. Norm Witten came in that time, along with Dick Rule for the stop for Oregon State. Second down coming up. Eight yards to go. The ball right now points. The top rusher on the team taking that ball. Timberlake slides to his left. Now he circles back to his right. Michigan 
33. In motion goes Watkins, who's the fullback. Brothers goes back to pass, and he is hit before he gets the pass off and slammed back for a loss on the play. Bill Yearby, number 75, is the first man to get in there on the play. So it's second and 12 coming up. Second and 12, and just seconds to go here in this first quarter. One second to go. And that's the end of the first quarter with the score, Michigan nothing, Oregon State nothing. Can't find one, keeps the ball, goes forward and is hit hard as Al East 
the left end passes through to make the stop, along with Ozilovic on the play. Hartman came up also to aid. Side, spread to the left side. And the give is to Anthony, the fullback, as Anthony gets forward for a gain of three yards in the play to the 49-yard line. Carr and East came in for the stop that time for the uh, Oregon State Beavers. It'll be third down coming up and seven to go. The ball before the to the right. Bob Timberlake goes back to pass. He throws at it is complete to Farabee. The big end who was immediately spilled in his tracks. Ophelovich and Smith surrounding Farabee, big number 80. It's a first down for Michigan on the 43-yard line of Oregon State. Wide to the right. This time the give is to Carl Ward. He again cuts off the left side and comes forward to the 41-yard line. Smith, number 36, and Ovilovich, number 55, both in on the play for Oregon State. Right in the right end spot. And this time the uh, plunge is by Anthony as he goes off the right side, met by Rosario and Gould of the uh, Oregon State Beavers. On the uh, left side of the line, it'll be third down coming up and six to go on the ball right now is on the 38-yard line. Third and six to go. Pass play, brothers to McDougal, six for a touchdown. Timberlake has this incomplete attempt by Henderson. And so that means it'll be fourth down coming up, Bob. We've seen quite a bit of passing all of a sudden out here, uh, Bob, and we might note that for Michigan, Timberlake now has completed four out of six, while for Oregon State, Paul Brothers, to boot, it's fourth and four in this punting situation. There's the snap from center. Kemp angles it toward the sideline. It hits and goes out of bounds. And it will be uh, brought in from out of bounds and spotted at the 14-yard line as Oregon State takes over at this point. And this time, it's the gift to Watkins, who is hit hard by the right side of the Michigan line and thrown for a loss on the play. Coming in from the linebacker spot, Patrick Brew, Nunley, and Chikini, the two linebackers, and the uh, loss on the play of one yard. Field on the play. Berkitich now leaves the ball game. McDougal comes in at that end spot. It'll be second and ten. Ball at the 28 yard line. Oregon State holds a 7 0 lead. This time Grimm is a uh, split left end. In motion goes Watkins. Brothers back to pass. Looks for more. Now looks for McDougal. And his pass is short to McDougal. Incomplete. McDougal tried to trap that one, but it was incomplete, so a new unit is now coming in for Oregon State with third and ten. And Sigurd is a lone safety for Michigan. It's a third and ten situation here. There's a beautiful final four downfield. Sigurd takes it on the 20. He's back to the 25, up to the sideline, gets to the 30, and is hit. Along the sideline at the 30 as he's marching around to the 31 yard line. Eflin came up to make that tackle. A 52 yard kick that time. A flag on the play. Looks like a clipping penalty. Against the Michigan Wolverines.
Timberlake kicks. It is high. It is wide. It is so good. There's Simon Lefield with the score. Oregon State 7, Michigan 6. Bob Wolf along with Bob Blackburn here at the Rose Bowl where an 84-yard touchdown run after a pitch-off by Timberlake to Mel has really made for excitement. Some uh, Michigan fans threw a maize smoke-colored smoke bomb down there that the officials finally were able to get off the field. And we might know it while they're still waiting for the smoke to clear from down there. But that tremendous run, beautiful blocking out in front of him, and a great run by Anthony, establishes a new Rose Bowl record for the longest run from scrimmage of 84 yards. The old record was 81, held by Bob Jeter of Iowa against California in 1959. So with 6.34 left in the first half, it's Oregon State leading Michigan 7-6, and we're set for the kickoff. Timberlake approaches the ball. There's the boot. It's going down to the three-yard line. We're taken by Watkins. Watkins right back the middle of the 15. He's hit hard the 15. Falls forward to the 19-yard line. Rick Wolf made a beautiful tackle. And that ball will be spotted at the 19-yard line as Oregon State takes over. Both touchdown drives started instantly on the 16-yard line. 19 yard line. And this time, Brothers on the draw play ends up to Shaw. And Shaw off the left side goes forward to the 23 yard line as Shaw gets his first carry of the afternoon. Bill Keating came in to make the stop. 23 yard line. Younger brother of Tom Keating, a top tackle for the Wolverines the last season. Back in the ball again. Holland is the split back off to the right. Brothers goes back to pass. He looks. A throw is incomplete, intended for Walland. Making a dive for the ball for Michigan was Rick Volk. Their defensive left half back, but the pass was down to the ground incomplete. So it's third and seven to go. That ball right back at the 23-point formation. He'll be uh, standing on his own eight-yard line. Rick Sigger, a sole safety. Here's the boot on the third down kick. Another high, booming spiral. Beautiful boot. Carries down the 25. Sigger has it there. Back to the 30. Goes forward to the 35. And is tackled as he crosses the 35. Going forward to the 38-yard line. Dennis Rosario and Norm Witten come down for the tackle. A 52-yard boot that time. As Michigan takes over at this point. Bob Wolf along with Bob Blackburn at the Rose Bowl to give this time to Anthony. Anthony crashes off the right side again for good yardage, moving forward to the 45 this time. Obilovich comes up for the stop. And it'll be uh, second on coming up and that ball spotted at the 45. Three to go for the Wolverines in their own 45. Timberlake rolls out. He's going to pass. He pulls. That it is. It's just intended for Jim Detweiler. Overthrown just a bit as Detweiler went down the left sideline, closest to us. Jim Smith, number 36, guarding Detweiler, number 48 on the play. Big Jim Detweiler, a sophomore, who's carried the ball 70 times this past Michigan's TD in the big game against Ohio State on a pass. Plunge off the right side this time, and the ball carrier is Dave Fisher. Hartman came in for the stop as Fisher moves that ball. Very close to a first down. But go to the sidelines. We may have a measurement. Maybe short. On their own 47 and a half yard line. Quarterback sneak. They may have made it. First down for Michigan. Center of the line. Plugged in there for Oregon State. But they couldn't stop that plus by Big Bob Timberlake. with 67 points and 80 points for the year. Slides to his left, keeps the ball and goes forward. Moving the ball into Oregon State territory at the Oregon State 46-yard line. George Carr and Jim Smith both up for the stop. And it'll be second on coming up and five to go. For the ball game is Oregon State 7, Michigan 9-yard line. Timberlake directing that team and the wing T slides to his right this time, throws the pass to the sideline, complete to Henderson who has not got a bound, and to take that sideline pass to the 37-yard line. This Timberlake is well worth talking about. A three-year regular, his uh, total offense mark is the uh, highest in Michigan history for one season. He had 80 points this year. 
Spencer's choice. He flies to his left this time. Back to pass. 
takes one pass, keeps the ball, and now goes out of bounds, stopping the clock. He saw he couldn't pick up any yardage if he tried to go forward, so he uh, went out of bounds, stopping the clock, with the ball being brought into the 40-yard line, where it's fourth down coming up, and five to go, and Oregon State gets set to boot here, with just 17 seconds left to go in the first half of play. Len Perkett possession. They don't send a safety man back. And uh, the ball goes sailing far over Sigurd's head as they just let it roll. With seconds to go, it's still rolling inside the 10-yard line to the 8-yard line. And it'll be down there at the 8-yard uh, line. The scoreboard clock shows the time has run out. And that's the end of the first half with the score. Michigan 12 and Oregon State 7. Second half kickoff in just a moment. Captain Conway meeting with uh, Oregon State Fielders at uh, the middle of the field. Here's the the 
the surge after that 45 yard punt to Downham on the play. So now ball becomes the top model, Bob Timberlake directing that wing T. Timberlake this time gives to Folk, and Folk running from the uh, halfback spot is hit as he gets to the line of scrimmage and goes down with little or no gain in the play. Ward is coming back in the backfield now for the Wolverines, and Henderson is also coming in. Out of the ball game comes last year. Out of the ball game comes Reinfuss. And just about 10 to go. Second and 10 to go. And this time the give is to the halfback Ward. Ward moves forward to the 15-yard line where he's filled. On the play this time, coming up for the stop was the uh, big guard on the team, Warren Cole, who came in for a hard stop on the play. And this time for Michigan. Going back to pass is Timberlake. He throws to Henderson, completes to Henderson, who takes the ball out of bounds on a short pass as he takes out of bounds on the 21-yard line. Short pass to the big end, John Henderson, out of bounds just across the 20 at the 21. Score of the ball game is Michigan 12, Oregon State 7. Kemp, waiting for the stop from center, gets off the kick. Good spiral going toward the sidelines and going out of bounds. That kick barely crossed the uh, midfield stripe on the angle as it went out of bounds. And it will be uh, brought in, put in play on the Oregon State 48-yard line. take over right now. First this time is flanked wide to the right. The left end is split. Brothers, this time the draw gives to Watkins. And Watkins is hit and brought down for a loss on the play as Bob Milky comes in for the stop along with Bill Lasky for the Michigan Wolverines. Ball spotted right now at the 46-yard line. It'll be second and 12 to go. The coast go at it. This time in the uh, I formation, Brothers goes back to pass. He throws to Moreland, who makes a dive for the ball and gathers it in right at the 49-yard line. He made a fine dive of the ball, and he was right down on the ground as he gathered in the ball on the catch. That ball spotted at the 49, still in Oregon State territory. Perkitich comes in at the end spot. Sullivan goes out, and it's third. And eight to go for the Beavers, who trail the ball game by a score of 12 to 7 to Michigan's Oregon State. Right at right half back is flank. Back to pass goes. What is he being chased by Simpkins? And he's being pulled for loss by Keating. Bill Keating, number 68, came crashing through for the tackle. And to Arnie Simpkins, number 70, gave chase. The right guard, right tackle combining to crash through there and throw brothers for a loss. Bob Wolf, we're seeing right here one of the reasons why their line is put on today. And now it's punt formation. Perkitich with a fourth and 20 situation. Back to punt. And the punt is blocked by Michigan. Ball is fumbled with the carriage away the field. Michigan takes over on the 15 yard line as well as he pulls to the ball. Back in for 
Oregon State. There'll be fourth down coming up and two yards to go. Fourth and two. The ball is at the seven-yard line in Oregon State territory. The big play coming up now this ball game. Fourth and two. They give to Deadwiler. He plays it down the right side for a first down. Jim Deadwiler goes for a first down. It'll be first and goal to go at the three-yard line. We pause now for station identification. Michigan Fall, Oregon State Territory. Detweiler is the carrier. Off the right side, close to the goal line, and still just short of the goal line. Jim Detweiler. Carried the ball 70 times this past year, averaging four yards per play, and scored three touchdowns. The ends are alternating, bring and play, as Melody comes back in to Smith. So from the goal, and this time, Wolverines on the Oregon State 42. 
This time it's both the ball carrier, and as he tries to cut in off his right tackle, he spill and goes down after a gain of a yard on the play. Ball spotted at the 40-yard uh, line. Gould and Rule came in for the stop for the Oregon State Michigan 20 and Oregon State 7. 3.39 to go in this third quarter of play. Timberlake slides, keeps, and goes forward across the 35 to the 34-yard line. Big six foot four, 215-pound back. He's tough to bring down. Timberlake has and four to go. In motion goes Volk, the left halfback, moving off to his right. Timberlake back to pass. Throws down the middle, incomplete. And there's a flag on the play. State 25. There's a wide pitch out to Ward. Ward off the right side. Going to that sidelines and picks up good yards before he's knocked out of bounds. How that fella can scoop this ball to the 14 yard line. Tom Mouse came over to lead the interference on the play. He is the son of Roy Mouse, Cleveland Indians baseball fame. And he opened up that right side for the Wolverines. And this time, a good to the uh, fullback kicker who rams his way forward inside the 10 to the 8 yard line. Dave Speaker, who is a 210 pound, five ten back, ramming his way forward. And he's still going down. The ball on the 8. This time, once again, it's a good to the Who is a three-year veteran? Played at the Liberty Bowl a couple of years ago. 
fastly in rushing. And this time it's Anthony going right down the middle as he goes to the 47-yard line. Michigan was eighth in the nation in total offense. And there's the end of the third quarter with the score, Michigan 27, Holland State 7. Great running quarterback, he can also pass that ball. And here we have a quarterback sneak, which looks like it's picked up on the play. Four yards as a flag on the play. As the ball is moved forward to the 44-yard line, Doug John and Jack Obilovich in the shot. Bob Leiper, all of these kind of interesting uh, between quarters and the goal. They're on 42. And this time, the uh, ball carrier is Mel Anthony once again. As the top rusher on the Michigan team moves that ball forward to the 47-yard line, Jack Madrog Obilovich, of all the attackers, he made the NEA All-America first-team defense for the uh, Arlington State University Beavers. Waiting for the pass from center. And there's the boot. It's a uh, rather wobbly spiral which hits on the 25 but has a good roll all the way down to the 12-yard line and is down at the 13 as it rolls back on a reverse spin just one more yard. So Arlington State takes over. Let's see who may put him there now. It's that 41-yard boot. Arlington State taking the ball and We'll probably have to go to the airwaves now in order to hear last season, but has only thrown seven passes this year, completing three. Clean back to pass, throws towards the sideline, completes the ball with a flank back for little or no game of play as Morland on that pass back in the flat is brought down by the left halfback, Rick Volk, number 49, going over for a quick tackle. And that ball will be spotted right now. And McDougal. And clean calling signals in the I formation, back to pass. And throws it in! Complete to Grimm. Makes a beautiful grab. Right foot, number 17. The defensive back went up with him for the Wolverines. But Grimm wrestled that ball free. And it's a first down for Oregon State. Now, Perkitich goes in replacing Sullivan at an end spot. And at the other quarter, two and a half. Back to Bob, now we're set to go with two new ends in the ball game, a new quarterback, and Shaw, the new fullback in motion. On the draw play, the ball is given to Booker Washington, and he is thrown for a loss. Coming in was big number 94, Jerry Mater, to lead the charge for the Wolverines, the 6'3", 225. Now lost on the play, fourth quarter of play. This time it's clean back to pass, and he throws deep down the middle, and it is incomplete. Bigger, the defensive back, made a dive for that ball. It was intended for Scott Miller, the left end, and it was almost intercepted. Simpkins put on the... 11.52 to go in the game as Brothers rolls out behind good on the fence and slips as he tries to turn the corner and goes down the ground at the 22-yard line. The fourth down coming up, 14 yards to go. A lot of the aspects of the Arlington State high formation resembles the old single wing in many swings out to help lead the interference. Back in punt formation is Perkovic. There's the uh, boot by Perkovic. Gets off a fine kick. Lineford gathers it in on the 35 and moves back to the 46-yard line before he's brought down. 42-yard boot that time. Dick Lineford is a fellow who injured his ankle severely during the year in the Illinois game yards fewer than the Wolverine offense gained. Maven tough to score on today. Timberlake rolling with the ball. Keith gets to midfield, goes out of bounds at the 46-yard line in Arlington State territory. Parkman came over to knock him out of bounds. Michigan is a last appeared in the Rose Bowl beating California 14-6. They're trying to keep their record on Sully. Timberlake back to pass. Now decides to keep the ball. Back to the line of scrimmage to go. It keeps going to the 40, to the 35, and tight ropes his way down the right sideline before being knocked out of bounds to the 32. And Norm Whitten finally goes Timberlake out of bounds. And a first down for Michigan once again. Bob Wolf, there's one of the reasons why Timberlake was a consensus All-American back. The fellow is back to pass. 
Chris Jimchen, the ball started at the 31, Timberlake this time, hands up to Detweiler. Detweiler goes off the right side and goes forward to the 23 yard line before he's dropped on the play. The blocking was left that time by Butler and by Kai. Osberg came in for the stop. And it's second down coming up. Second and three. Timberlake flies to his left, keeps the ball. the kickoff, Augustly puts the ball in play on the 32-yard line, and Watkins makes the carry from the 32 to the 37. The kickoff, a short one, second and five, and the ball is in the Oregon State 37. They trail 34 to seven. Queen in the eye, back to pass, rolls down the middle, and it's complete to Moreland. Moreland is down at the 48-yard line after making the reception there as Chiquiti and Sigur come up for the stop. That 23-yard touchdown run by Bob Timberlake. Timberlake keeping the score. They won 54 yards in five plays. It's first and 10 for Oregon State. Queen throw is complete to Miller, and Miller is down in his tracks after catching that short pass. Chiquiti and Reinfuss come up to make the stop of the Wolverine 46-yard line. Four to go. Shaw on the backfield. And the uh, flags go down before the play gets on the way. So there'll be a uh, penalty coming up as it's being stepped off against Oregon State. Second and eight yards to go. In motion goes Watkins. Queen out the pass. Looks, throws, and it is complete intended for Moreland, their flanker back. Yerby came in on the play defensively for the Michigan Wolverines. <laughs> Michigan, only all coaching record on the coast over the past 10 years in wins, losses, and ties. Back to pass goes Queen. Throws down the middle, and it is incomplete and almost intercepted. Rick Volk, number 49, made a dive for the ball, almost intercepted off the hands of Moreland, who barely had his fingertips on the ball. This vote came up, so with fourth down and nine, Oregon State decides to run with the ball, and as they go off the left side, they have not picked up the yardage for the first down. Brothers was the runner, and he has run out of bounds after going forward to the 45-yard line of Michigan, but Wackenbach versus Texas. Set to go as Evershevsky hands up as a big hole and Fisher finds his way through it as he goes forward all the way to the 43 yard line and Oregon State territory for a first down. Abilovich makes the stop there. In at the end spots right now, we have played curtain at a 
by halfback, Lee at another halfback, and Evashevsky. Gibbs is to Lee, number 40, Lewis to 40, and he is out of the 38-yard line. Lewis Lee, who is 6'2", 190 pounds. Bill Muir is thrown into the uh, game. Chuck Lazica is in. This time the uh, handoff is to Dick Wells, who goes off the left side, moving that ball forward to the 36. Wells' dad, Robert Wells, is on the 1933 Wolverine squad. So we have a brand new Michigan team in there, getting their taste first down for the Wolverines. And a plunge off the left side by Fisher is close to the first down. Let's see whether or not he makes it as he goes forward for about two and a half to three yards on the play. it by inches. It's fourth and inches to keep possession of the ball. And there's a plunge by Fisher, which looks like a pick up the first down. However, there's an illegal motion signal being given down below on the field as the flag goes down. So Michigan, guilty of illegal motion on the play. Dave Fisher scored two touchdowns this past year. He's a highly heralded... Roll over five. Abyshevsky back to pass. He throws and it is complete. Makes the sideline catch. Takes the ball out of bounds right with him is Craig Kirby, who caught six passes this year. And it's a first down for Michigan. Kirby making the catch. Oregon State is experiencing the same difficulty today. This time it's Valley to win. He fumbles the ball. And it's recovered by Oregon State. takes over on their own 32-yard line. Dennis Rosario, a big stop. And now it's Oregon State's ball. Here's a pass that is completed to the 42-yard line. Miller, number 87, taking that pass. Gordon Queen doing the throwing. Mike Bass, number 15, who has also just come in the ball game for Michigan been able to gel against the Wolverines in the second half of play. Green back to pass. He's being rushed. He's filled for a loss. Green filled back to the 34-yard line. Coming in that time with the tackle, Rich Hahn, number 65. Don Bailey, number 55. Hahn, fine uh, tackler, was injured earlier this season out of the operation, and he too is back in action. And... 19 to go. In motion goes Coston. Queen gives off to Shaw. Shaw's to the 40, and he's doing his feet at the 45 with fine balance, and finally goes down at the 47-yard line. He's an excellent ball carrier. And although he's been injured a great deal of this year, Shaw has been giving a good account of himself. It was a good running call on that play. It's third and six. Queen back to pass. Throws a screen pass to Watkins. Complete. Watkins is at the 40. Watkins to the 35 and the 30. And it's knocked out of bounds. He crosses the 30 along the near sideline. Knocked out of bounds the 26 yard line. Wally Gabler came over to drive him out of bounds. minutes of this football game. Queen directing the team, just uh, his last game. And the give this time is to Watkins, who slants off the left side. Watkins going forward to the 23-yard line is met by Dennis Flanagan, number 64 for Michigan spot. It's second down. The Oregon State fans are chanting, we want a touchdown. Queen throws a beautiful catch to Scott Miller. At the 14. And this is a particular beautiful play because Miller slipped and fell. And while he was lying on the ground, Queen had to hit him right where he was and did right where he had fallen. However, there's a flag on the play, a personal foul against Oregon State for 15 yards. I understand, but he has and has done a fine job. 
So it's second down coming up, 15 to go. The ball is on the 40 in Michigan territory. Queen back to pass. He throws to Watkins. Watkins at the 35. Whips as he tries to cut back toward the center of the field and goes down at the 31-yard line. Gary Schick came up along with Barry Lynn for the stop. At the 31-yard line, there's a minute and 47 seconds left to play in the ball game. Runs out on the Rose Bowl game. Green back to pass. Looks. Throws a little flat pass to Shaw. Shaw is at the 30. Cuts the corner at the 30. Goes to the 25 as he tight ropes down the far sideline. Does not get a bound to the 22-yard line. Coming over is late Will Height. Along with Lewis Lee to drive him out of bounds. To rack up more points on the scoreboard. Fourth and five. Green back to pass. He throws and it is complete. Miller once again latches on the ball. He's driven out of bounds at the 18-yard line. It'll be very close to a first down. We'll see whether or not they pick it up. It's an before this ball game comes to an end. Trying to score another touchdown. Waiting for the measurement. First down for Oregon. First and ten to go. Rolling out is Queen. He keeps the ball. He's the 15 to 10. He's at the five-yard line as he goes down there. Gordon Queen rolling out, keeping at the five. It's first and goal to go. I'd like to thank our spotters this afternoon. Chuck Collins of Michigan, Tom Holly of Oregon State University, both of whom have been fine. Timberlake, and there 